a capable, courteous and professional front office staff member can contribute to making each guest stay a pleasant experience and in the process encourage the guest's desire to return. Guests generally have more contact with front office staff than with any other hotel department staff. As a result, to many guests, the front office is the hotel. A well-trained front office staff strives to meet guests' needs while also ensuring smooth and profitable hotel operations. But this is not always an easy task. So how can you be a successful front desk member? Let's get started. Being familiar with company procedures and being able to identify customer needs facilitates efficient work practices and promotes guest satisfaction. When dealing with guest arrivals, look up guests that are expected to check in, familiarize oneself with guest names and the number of arrivals expected. If one expects a large number of arrivals, one must organize additional assistance in advance. Always finish one check-in before moving on to another. When dealing with guests on arrival, when the guest approaches the desk, look up, smile and according to the time of day say, Good morning, afternoon, evening, sir or madam. Welcome to the hotel. How may I help you? If you know the guest's name, use it. When the guest requests accommodation, Follow through by, ask the guest what type of room, if required, and for how long. Quote the rate for the room, making certain to include special offers and promotions if applicable. Ask the guest if he or she wishes to go ahead and check in. Ensure that all details are checked with the guest. Proceed with obtaining authorization for payment. Give the guest the registration card and a pen and ask him or her to sign and check the details. Ask if the guest requires a wake-up service, a newspaper or has any special requests. Hand the guest the key to the room and provide clear directions on how to find it. Ensure the room number is not mentioned to maintain confidentiality. Ask if the guest requires any assistance with their luggage and arrange for a porter if necessary. End by saying, enjoy your stay with us. Please let us know if we can do anything to make your stay more comfortable. Unexpected arrivals impact on housekeeping, the kitchen and the restaurant. So they need to be informed so that they can accommodate these guests into their plan for the day. Remember, as front desk staff, it is your responsibility to always convey the warmth of the establishment. Your communication and approach directly influences the guest's future decision of either returning to the same hotel or not. Once a guest's needs have been established, it becomes possible to recommend products that meet these needs or offer alternatives. It is important to offer alternatives because the customer is assured that the establishment will try their best to accommodate their needs. Customers like having options available and they may be informed of a better option that they may not have thought of before. Alternatives can ensure customer satisfaction and bring in additional revenue for the establishment. As you can conclude, the first impression statement plays an extremely important part of the atmosphere, image and sense of welcome that front desk creates. In part two, we will discuss this further. Good day to you. Are you ready to get going with part two of this video on front desk? Excellent. In the previous video, we discussed company procedures and guest arrivals, establishing a guest needs and the ability to offer alternatives. Now let us look into guest reservations. Guest reservations are the principal source of revenue for the business. Manual or computerized systems are used for making reservations. Whenever a guest makes a reservation and the guest has selected a room, 
it is important to record their information or reservation details. There are several particulars that need to be recorded to enable a hotel to provide the guest with flawless services. Each detail serves an important purpose. The reservation details will also be transferred onto the arrival registration card and the lodging contract, so spelling and accuracy are vital. Significant details that must be documented include Arrival date Departure date Room type Number of rooms Number of guests Room price Tariff type Release or guarantee Surname of guest First name of guest Title of guest Any special requests or preferences for example non-smoking sofa bed, wake-up service, etc. The ETA, expected time of arrival, contact telephone number, email address if appropriate, home address if appropriate, company details if appropriate, travel agent details if appropriate, payment details, booker, this is the person who made the reservation, booker's telephone details. Once the guest details have been accurately recorded and confirmed with the guest, confirmation must be printed and issued to the guest. Front desk staff must take every opportunity to promote the hotel's facilities and services. The more information the guest has about the products and services of the establishment, the more use he or she is likely to make of them. By increasing the guest's awareness of the establishment's products and services, we are creating increased sales. By promoting the products and services, you are also in the position to obtain feedback about the products and services that the guests are most likely to use. This information can be passed on to the relevant department head. When describing the establishment's products and services, it is useful to explain the features and benefits of the product or service. Only if and when the establishment's own facilities do not meet the guest's needs should you provide information about outside facilities and services. Front desk staff must be clearly aware of the establishment's list of products and services and have an in-depth knowledge of these. A range of services and facilities include sleeping accommodation. This may be special features such as DSTV, or air conditioning and special rooms such as the honeymoon suite. Functions. It is important to know what sort of functions the establishment caters for and to what extent. Conference. By knowing details of conference facilities, one can easily respond to guest questions and promote supporting facilities. Exhibit room. Find out if the establishment has a special exhibition room for hosting exhibitions or if a general room is available. Restaurant. It is important to know what restaurants, bars and coffee shops are available. Apart from having the knowledge to provide guests with information, front desk must also be able to request the correct information to retrieve guest details. As guest confidentiality is important, information cannot simply be provided without verification against the recorded details. To attend to an inquiry and search for a booking on the system, one must obtain certain guest-related information, namely the guest's name, address and telephone number, company or travel agency, date of arrival and departure, type and number of rooms requested, number of people in the group if applicable, method of payment and or guarantee, and lastly, any special requests. Once this information has been used to locate the booking, the details must be checked with the guest and any inquiries can be attended to accordingly. So, Front Desk is responsible for taking care of the guests before they arrive, creating a welcoming environment when they check in and ensuring that they are kept comfortable throughout their stay. But, does Front Desk have other responsibilities? We will answer that question in part 3. I will see you again in part 3 of this video.
Welcome! I guess you are back to find out what other responsibilities fall into front desk. Let's answer that. The responsibilities of front desk staff includes the allocation of duties. In allocating duties amongst the portering staff, it is important that there is always someone available to meet, greet and assist arriving guests accordingly. This may include opening car doors, greeting and welcoming guests, directing guests to reception, offering to have the guest car parked or directing the guest to parking, removing luggage from the car and taking it into the establishment, awaiting the completion of registration formalities and escorting guests to their room with the luggage. While one porter is escorting guests to their rooms, another porter should be at the door ready to greet and assist the next arrival. In establishments that have a doorman, he will greet guests on arrival and porters will assist with the luggage. When there is no porter available, the doorman may assist to bring the luggage into the establishment lobby. When the patrons are ready to leave, the porter collects the luggage and loads it so that it is ready to go. Hotel porters may also run errands on behalf of guests, such as picking up theatre tickets, dropping off and collecting dry cleaning, calling cabs and similar tasks. There are various roles in the portering function, which require continuous coordination and management. These are categorised as Concierge This is the establishment's information desk. A good concierge can answer a guest's questions on almost any aspect of the establishment's services or facilities in the area. He can also arrange excursions, theatre tickets, taxis and supply newspapers. Porter unloads the vehicles, assists guests with check-in and check-out and distribute luggage. Bellboy is a junior porter found only in large establishments. Doorman is also employed in large establishments and duties include keeping the door, welcoming guests security control, as well as helping guests with parking and taxis. Valet, porter's linen and laundry supplies. Night porter, is not simply a porter as he or she takes over the responsibilities of the door staff. While front desk carries out registrations, it must be noted that a group check-in is carried out differently than a booking for an individual guest. When making a group check-in, unlike the standard procedure followed, additional information is required. This allows for a smooth processing of a large number of people in a relatively short period of time. The additional information calls for Confirmation of the travel arrangements, for example, the bus company or flight details. Allocated rooming lists, which is the pre-ordered arrangements for sharing. Cancellation policies. Late cancellations incur a penalty or full payment. Key or card provisions in advance allows for smooth processing. Method of payment. Prepayment on company account. Extra arrangements. Which items can be billed against the group account and which items need to be settled by the individual. Group check-ins may be carried out more efficiently when preparations are made in advance of the group's arrival. Preparing keys or key cards and registration cards in advance and separating these from individual bookings is one way of assisting with the check-in. Arranging for additional assistance with porters on standby is also an effective contribution to easier group check-ins. Front Desk is faced with dealing with several different types of customers on a daily basis. They must be prepared to handle different registrations, customers with varied needs and to attend to complaints and system failures. So what is the best approach? Front Desk should always remember, you can always tell if a guest is approaching you for assistance and you can make it easier for the guest to request assistance by offering it before he or she asks. If a guest looks lost or as though they are looking for someone or something, approach them politely and ask, Good day, sir, madam, how can I help you? 
always observe what is happening around you and respond to the signals guests give relating to their needs. There may be times when you cannot attend to a guest immediately, such as when you are busy with another guest. At such times, it is important to acknowledge the guest. Say something like, Good day, ma'am. I will be with you in a moment. When you are able to attend to the waiting guest, apologize for the delay. Always ask the customer questions until you are clear exactly what the requirements are. From everything we have talked about, it certainly seems that front desk is the central point for all the hotel operations. With all the activity that front desk faces on a daily basis, they are sure to encounter a few special circumstances. When we get to part 4 of this video, we will take a look at special circumstances that they may face. I look forward to seeing you again in part 4 of this video. Great, you're back. Are you ready to get started with part 4 of the video Front Desk? Front Desk is responsible for several duties and on a daily basis they face different situations which they need to effectively, professionally and calmly attend to. Communication is key at the Front Desk and Front Desk staff will also have to deal with communication under special circumstances. These include Communication difficulties. If a guest is having difficulty understanding the language, speak slowly and clearly. Use your hands to explain what you are trying to say. If necessary, draw pictures. If there is someone else in the establishment that speaks the guest's language, request the assistance of that person. Mobility difficulties. If the person wishing to check in is in a wheelchair, it is preferable for the front desk attendant to go around the desk and attend to the guest from a position that is more comfortable to the guest. Inform switchboard so if the guest has any difficulty, this can be dealt with as quickly as possible. Guests with children. It is important to accommodate the needs of children and this adds to the positive experience enjoyed by the parents. Greet children and make them feel special. Offer baby cots and promote babysitting facilities if the establishment has them. Inform the restaurant if a high chair will be needed. Regular customers or VIPs. If the guest is a regular, do not request that they complete the entire registration form. Simply ask them to sign and inform you of the method of payment. Check that the details provided by the guest history are still correct. As with all environments, staff are faced with unexpected situations. There will be occasions when front desk is faced with a situation they find difficult to deal with. These are situations that staff are trained on but can be quite difficult to deal with when it actually happens. One way of making this easier is by continuous training and simulations. A few of these unexpected situations may be inebriated and disorderly guests. Begin by asking them to be a little quieter as they are disturbing other guests. If you have already asked them to quieten down and have been unsuccessful, do not get into an argument. Continue to remain calm. If you get upset, the guests will only become more disorderly. If they refuse to quieten down, ask for assistance from a manager. If the customer is staying at the establishment, offer to escort them to their room. If they are not staying at the establishment, offer to get them a taxi to take them home. If all attempts have been unsuccessful, the last resort taken would be to call for security. Equipment or system failure. In the event of a computer problem or breakdown, inform the supervisor immediately, then proceed to address the guest. If a guest wishes to check in when the computer system is still out of order, Manually record which customers have arrived. Obtain a listing of vacant ready rooms from housekeeping and keep the list on the reception desk. When a customer arrives, mark off the rooms that have been allocated. 
If the point of sale machine goes offline from the bank while an authorization is being processed, write the credit card number and the expiry date on the guest registration card. Process the card manually and hand this to the supervisor who will process it once the point of sale is back online. Once the computer system is back online, all the registration details must be entered into the computer system. Rude or aggressive guests. It can be very challenging to deal with rude or aggressive guests. The best way to deal with this behavior is to remain calm. Watch their body language and determine how to deal with the situation. Taking the heat from the guest will enable you to get the guest to calm down and still give the best service. As a front desk staff member, it is important to always have an action plan to solve unexpected situations. Identify the nature of the incident, acknowledge the guest, offer assistance, hear the guest out, empathize, apologize and reassure the guest. And lastly, take responsibility for solving the problem. It is evident that the role of the front desk personnel is one that requires a great sense of responsibility, patience and the ability to work under pressure. From the time a guest makes a reservation and arrives at a hotel through the time they depart, front desk staff play the central role in coordinating resources and services designed to meet the guest's needs. Guests will contact front desk staff with questions, requests, comments and complaints. Front desk staff who effectively anticipate, respond and address these challenges help exceed the expectations that the hotel guests have. Just as the hotel's architecture and style are important in setting the theme, front desk personnel play an integral role in defining the hotel's image. The variety of talents and skills required to satisfy guest needs make front desk work interesting and rewarding.